Yo, what's going on guys, it's me Manti and in this video I finally get my hands on Max Gunslinger and let me tell you, this unit is just crazy overpowered. His mana gains plus armor penetrations are insane. I would highly recommend maxing him out ASAP. Remember when you decide to do that, do it while using my code MANTI in the Rush Royale market. Well, enjoy the watching. Alright, first of my gameplay, like true gameplay of uh, Gunslinger. Gunslinger with Bart with Zeus, unfortunately not with Fortuna because I don't have Fortuna, sadly. Um, but it is what it is, uh, we have to play with what we have. And that's basically it. Uh, the strategy is to build your two knight statues on the Zeus style, plus one gunslinger to tier seven, and then the the rest two with bars, of course. That's pretty simple. Um, sadly, I'm not getting any gunslinger. It's, um, the faster you get your gunslinger, the better, and uh, just because you can start moving your units on the Zeus styles. Uh, it's it's really a cheat code in my opinion with with uh, with gunslinger. It's it, it really is. Uh, it's really OP in my opinion. Uh, but yeah, I will see. Uh, maybe it will uh, receive a slight nerf. Maybe to some armor penetration. Maybe to some mana gain. Uh, but in current form, uh, this unit is just crazy in my opinion. And you will just see how how he really is OP and that I'm saying the truth. Uh, Alright, so we have two of our bards, uh, so the strategy is to make a one accord, of course, and then we just basically um, scrap away everything, yeah, sadly, okay, and of course press Zeus uh, off cooldown, if you don't have Zeus you can play Gadget, you can play maybe Mermaid. Uh, but I know that it really works well with both Fortuna and Zeus, so that's just the idea. And of course, it's pretty simple. Uh, you just scrap, press your Gunslinger ability for that uh, small uh, amount of extra mana, at least in early game. Uh, in later stages, it is much more. Uh, and yeah, you just scrap away, that's the gameplay, that's the strategy, you press Zeus off cooldown, you press uh, you press a Gunslinger ability off cooldown as well, you don't really focus on stacks uh, that much in early game. Uh, I'm actually... No, you know what, it's okay. Uh, he can stay. Uh, it's it's really a cheat code with, with Gunslinger, especially with Bard, just because you can not worry that much about the merge ranks on Zero Styles, because you can just move them away uh, in later stages. It's just crazy in my opinion. Uh, I already had games uh, seven plus minutes with this deck. It's it's really OP. Uh, I saw people uh, reaching uh, also seven minutes, 30 seconds. I saw that uh, Aleppo and Kuliane uh, reached eight minutes. Uh, I think it's for the first time in the history of Deathwave. Um, but of course, it, it, it was without armor. So please uh, take a note of that. Um, so yeah, uh, basically the strategy is to build your Gunslinger to tier 7 and once your Knight Statues are tier, both tier 7, you can move them whenever, wherever basically you want. Uh, it's that simple. Uh, so yeah, uh, honestly I thought about uh, the strategy for this deck and I thought that maybe I could... Uh, for example, in this situation, even though I don't have statue tier 2, I can already uh, move around my Gunslinger and that's what I think I will do. Um, at least I will move this guy out of the Zeus style so that my next part is getting merge ranks. Uh, and like, just like I said, it's, it's really a cheat code in my opinion, especially with those pumpkins, 1000 mana for each. That's mind blowing to me. Uh, Alright, and one of our Knight Statue is tier... Uh, knight Statue, yeah. It's tier 7, so we can just move and move again. It's that simple. And now we are going to look for another Bard. And basically that would be it. Uh, I just forgot to press the ability. I keep on forgetting, in, at least in early stages. In later stages I, I press it all the time. 
All right, so let me find the guy, the bard. All right, and let's move him. Uh, so yeah, now let's just uh, press Zeus and we will focus on getting our second accordionist. And once th once this guy, um, all right, yeah. And of course, Blazing Barons are not a threat anymore uh, because you just uh, you can just move uh, units with Gunslinger and not have your merge rank reduced. Uh, it's really OP. All right, so now what we need is second accordionist. There we go. We got it. It's pretty simple. Uh, whenever you don't have the ability, you can move around your Gunslinger just for the small amount of mana. It's always something. And yeah. All right, now what I would like to have is another Bard so I can move him. Oh, maybe I'll, I can leave this, this guy here. Uh, yeah, give me Bard. Bard would be awesome now. Alright, perfect. Alright, so we can continue to getting uh, Inspiration stocks. As you can see, this guy is tier 7. So, I think... Hmm... Okay, you know what? Uh... Yeah, let's let's leave it. Uh, for now, it's okay. Uh, he can stay on the Zeus style. I don't really want to mess around with this too much. Uh, I, I just prefer to have more inspiration stacks. Uh, the faster, the better, of course. Uh... Oh wait, wrong, wrong one. All right, so we are at 150. So now would be awesome to get here to Bard anywhere, somewhere. And that's not here to Bard. Alright, perfect. So we get three Akros already. That's perfect. Um, tier 5 statue. Mm -mm -mm. I'm looking for to get uh, additional Bard. So I can move him on the Zeus style. But unfortunately I don't think I will get it. But that's okay. Uh, I don't have to rush um, with anything. Uh, I can just take a moment to get some inspiration stacks. As you can see, it's 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 going really fast, just because I have already high merge ranks of these accordionists. And yeah, so let's try to get to 300 uh, stacks, and then we will move our final accord uh, on the Zeus style, and that would be basically it. And as you can see, I press the ability. Look at how much mana I'm getting. That's that's just incredible. Look how much mana I'm getting. It's just additional mana. Look. And I can even move around my Gunslinger for even more mana. Like that's... If that's not OP, then I don't know what's OP. Look, look at the wave. I press the ability. And then I just kill all the monsters with plus 14 mana for each. That's insane. And I'm already at 300 stacks. It's not even a good result in my opinion because I'm talking, explaining to you. I'm not really fully focusing on the game. Uh, so yeah, in the death wave I'll try to focus a bit more on my gameplay. Uh, because that is uh, really needed. Alright, so let's move this guy. Let's eat this, eat this. You can eat this. Oh. Oh, thankfully I moved it just in time. And move this guy here because I will most likely place my knight statue, second knight statue here. And I can do it already now. And I can already focus on getting some... Um, yeah, let's burn 10,000 mana now. Oh, Gunslinger is going to kill it anyway. Okay, whatever. Um, yeah, and I will scrap on this, on this tile. Uh, all I need to do now is to get uh, two troppers somewhere, anywhere, and uh, doesn't really matter where. I don't even have to worry about amulet or whatever else. Uh, it's not really necessary uh, because eventually I will get it anyway. Uh, this part could stay, but I need second trapper. Second trapper would be awesome now. Oh, I have this one. All right, so that would be it basically. And I just scrap on these two. Um, 
on these two tiles. That would be my gameplay basically. And that's okay. That's perfectly fine. I would even prefer to reduce the merge ranks of this guy. Alright, let's kill Bedlam. Not even a problem, not the slightest. And always remember to reduce your scrapper merge ranks to not get stuck. And yeah, uh, all you do is to get inspiration stacks and, and that would be it. Because you don't struggle really with the board through the wave. All you do, uh, like 8 seconds before the, each boss, you press the ability on Gunslinger, you press Zeus. Uh, you hold like uh, two, until like 3-2 seconds the inspiration in the music mode. And then you just clear the wave and, and, and that's basically it. Like there is no secrets about it. Oh, that's perfect. Now that's perfect. See, 8 seconds I press ability, I press Zeus, and that's basically it. That's very simple. And also, yes, you, you can play it without Zeus, you can play it with, with Gadget or Mermaid if you don't have a legendary hero, and that would work as well, you're just not going to reach, most likely you won't reach like 7 minutes. But still, uh, if you have Max Gunslinger, if you have level 13 Gunslinger, uh, you can get... Uh, high scores as well uh, I don't see a reason why not um, let's move this guy I even killed this this guy without pressing a Zeus because I talked too much um, yeah let's let's get this chopper a bit high on merge ranks and then I will move another uh, random bard uh, to get uh, even more damage and see I just I just move around to not, not, to not lose the merge rank. And yeah, that's that would be it. I'm doing quite good with the with the inspiration so far. It's just that I'm getting uh, pretty stuck with the scrappers. Alright, let's clear the wave. I think we will get the ability now, uh, for the boss anyway. We press it and we clear the boss, the, the way. That's really satisfying. Alright. We can even move him around for some additional mana. An additional armor pen. I'm just afraid that I'm not going to get like 7 minutes with this deck while I'm talking to you guys trying to explain uh, what I'm doing and, and stuff uh, but maybe, maybe, who knows, maybe I can I'm not doing too bad right now so there is a hope alright, drop already tier 4, this one's tier 3, that's awesome 1300 uh, stacks of inspiration already, pretty good uh, let's move this guy around. Let's move him back. Get the bonus damage. And yeah, that would be basically it. Like, there is no dark magic that I'm doing. As you can see, it's basically scrapping. Uh, okay, let's move this guy, not lose the merge rank. And 8 seconds, we press this and this. And that's 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 basically it. Uh, so far, playing with this new way of, of, of playing uh, with Gunslinger, I didn't even get hit at 5 minutes by the boss. So, uh, that can tell you pretty a lot. Uh, about this deck. Or maybe I pressed the... Oh, I didn't. Okay, I misclicked. Nice. Alright. Let's get the Bard buff. And then we move him. Easy. Five minutes, not even close to being hit. Perfect. 
and as you can see, I always have like 25k mana. Like, it's crazy. Unfortunately, I cannot move him. I didn't have the cooldown yet. Alright, let's get the buff. Ooh, that was a bit closer. Maybe it's because I'm getting so stuck with the... Uh, with the scrappers. Okay, I have to focus now, it's 7 minutes. Okay, I got hit, but it's the pumpkin bonus, boss, whatever. Uh, okay. Ooh, I should have not eat that. Oh, it can screw my game. Okay, maybe I can do something about it. Alright, only this got hit. That's good. I got quite lucky. Oh, I got hit. Wow. Ah. Alright, we reached 7 minutes, I'm happy already. Oh no, he hit the gunslinger. Yeah, I don't think I can do anything. Yeah, <laughs> it wasn't perfect game. Yeah. Alright, we are already in the second game. Uh, this time around, I will try to not talk so much. Uh, just so I can uh, focus a little bit more, maybe we can get a, a higher um, higher score, and of course, um, uh, this time we are playing with epic chests, uh, just to, you know, mess around. Uh, would really love to get Gunslinger, perfect. Okay, let's move nice statue. And then we can move this knight statue. Uh, so I have one, two, three, four, five. So let's move this guy here. And then gunslinger on this. And then we we can already press it, I guess. And yeah, just scrub. Oh, you know what? Um, let's do that. Mm. Yeah, okay, that's good. Oh yeah, I have to eat this. Remember about pressing a, a Gunslinger ability and the use, of course. So I don't lose any uptime. Okay, good start. First wave, we are already uh, full setup, and uh, one of the statues is tier 5, Gunsling is tier 4. Ooh, nice, triple upgrade, perfect. Um, the only sad part is that I don't have Accordionist, um, kind of forgot about it. That's okay, maybe this one is going to be tier 4, uh, so I can merge them. Okay, another tier 4. Uh, this guy is tier 5. Mm. A little bit unlucky. Alright, Gunslinger tier 6. That's not a problem. The The real problem is with uh, Gunslinger and Knight Statues to get them ace up. I think that's the main thing that you need to focus with this deck. 
Right, this is tier 7, this is tier 6, this is tier 6, so I need measure on this guy. Yeah, both statues are tier 7. And uh, so all I need is this guy to get tier 6 and I will be good to go. Alright. Um, so yeah. Definitely one statue here, no questions. Then second statue here, I guess, would be good. Just if I can get it. Um, yeah, we can move this part here, and then we move statue over there. Um, shoot, yeah, like that. And then we will merge on this guy. Uh, just want to get some bar. Yes, perfect. Okay, I don't want that. Alright, perfect. So now we can focus a little bit more on setting our board. Uh, maybe I can get my second bard. Oh, nice, nice, very nice. Uh, okay, so I do this and this and that. And that. And I start getting inspiration. Now it would be lovely to move a bard here. Uh, I can try to summon one. Alright, perfect. Now we are in a really good spot. Uh, now all we need to do is uh, get our inspiration and that would be basically it. Then we can uh, continue. Okay. I could merge this, I could, but I don't think it's good. I would really love to get, okay, there we go. Uh, that's our second accord. I don't really want to move other bards on the Zeus tiles now, I prefer to get inspiration first, I think. Uh, yeah, I think that's the correct way to play. So let's get 150, then we set up the third accord, and then so on, so on. Now we can move around for some additional mana, of course. Do you scrapper? Alright, 230, uh, oh yeah, 150, so yeah, let's get our third accord now, hopefully now, okay, that's not barred, maybe that will be barred, nope. Okay, one barred is there. All I need to do now is get the second one. Hmm, wave six. Mm -hmm. This guy can stay, and that's not a problem. Okay, we got our third accord, and now I guess we move this guy. Then we try, we try to get uh, Aqua tier 1, if we can get it, perfect. 
And we continue with the inspiration. Oh, please don't get the red. Okay, it cleansed. Okay, six more stacks. Uh, let's reduce this. This guy is not. Is is on zero style? Okay. Um, so we need tier two now. Nice. It's very good. Uh, now we can move this bar here and chop her over there. And this part can go up there, and all we need is second chopper. Second chopper around here or here, and um, both places are fine. Just increase the merge rank of these guys as well. It's quite important. Not getting the chopper. Oh, just got it. Perfect. Alright, so now is the just a Zeus gameplay and inspiration. Can't really do anything about it. Alright, let's try to get uh, much more inspiration now. Okay. Yeah, this guy is still tier 3. Upgrade our units. Twenty two on the amulet, pretty stout, pretty, pretty okay. No, no, come on. Uh, I, I know what I can do. Almost forgot. Alright, tier 5, it's cool, uh, 700 for the uh, inspiration, Max Amulet. Hmm, <clears throat> I'm not sure if I have enough inspiration stocks at this point in the game. But I guess we'll find out. I guess I can do this. Oh, it hit me. Okay.
Oh, this guy didn't hit me. I don't know, maybe Monkey King is just way too tanky. 1150 inspiration stacks. Warlock, no problem. Forty five of those candies or whatever it is. Alright, 5 minutes boss, no problemo. Unless we are going to run into like Bedlam. Uh, I think we are fine. But yeah, let's, let's just see. One thousand four hundred inspiration. Okay. Always try to time uh, the movement of Gunslinger for the Banner Lords, as they are the, the tankiest ones. Oh, I moved my game. Sorry. Alright, six minutes. Nice. Oh, my nice touch. Well, nothing I can do. I got lost a bit. Okay, I'm back. As you can see, like seven minutes games are very intense. Oh, all right. We didn't break the record, but that's fine. Well, as you can see, this unit is just crazy good. Like I said. We didn't break any records, but we already had games over 7 plus minutes into the death wave in just the first day. If that is not impressive, then I don't know what is. If you enjoyed the video, consider liking and subscribing as it helps me grow my channel even more. Let me know down in the comments what are your thoughts about Gunslinger. Anyway, thanks for watching guys and stay awesome.